Okay, so when I was really young, I loved playing video games. And I kind of noticed that when you play video games, you have to be really, really focused. So if you're playing maybe Mario Kart um, on the Nintendo 64, so you're driving along, and of course there's a Koopa waiting to hit you. But if you blink or you say, oh, I need to get something to eat or I need some chips. So you put your controller down and wham, the Koopa smashes into you. So you die, you lose life. And of course, you you in video games you have plenty of lives, so it's okay. But in Bach, when you're performing, you don't have that kind of a privilege. So you have to stay really focused through the whole thing, and you can't stop. I think that was when I was um, five or six. I think six. Um, I went to this piano competition in Oakland, and my friend. Um, I was playing a piano concerto with my older piano teacher and I think that was the first time I ever played in public, which is kind of interesting because it wasn't actually a performance, it was a competition. I mean, of course I get nervous, so I just try to focus on the music itself. I try not to think about anything besides the music. So usually before I walk on stage, I'm just kind of um, playing the piece over to myself again and again and walking through some of the spots where I know I need to be um, focused on what kind of a sound or a character I'm producing. Often in Bach, if you make a big mistake, it's really difficult to find your way back. So it's almost necessary to just stop and start over again, which I've done that quite a few times. But if just little mistakes, like if you miss a couple of notes, I try to forget about that section and skip to maybe a few bars forward so that a few bars forward I know that I can keep playing and it will be fine.